Hello everybody, it is Robert Earl from the Eco Ranch in Far West Texas again. This time I don't have Cascade the Wonder Dog with me because I'm back at my friendly rock fall out here. I'm gonna get some rocks. And I'm gonna demonstrate to you the incredible new Winchomatic invention that one of my friends came up with. And no, this isn't a joke. It's not me doing a soupy shuffle. It's not me, me trying to get you to pay me $300 to come out and dig holes for me. Oh no, this is real. The Winchomatic. See, I have a couple of friends. I've, I've got more than a couple, <laughs> and I'm very grateful to them. But I have a couple of friends who helped me out on this one. Now, one saw me move Red Flintstone and the Giant Rock, and he felt so bad for me and my 64-year-old back moving all those rocks that he said, I'm going to help you out. So he sent me a one-ton portable winch, and it's been about two months ago, and about all I did was say thank you because I couldn't figure out exactly what to do with it. Well, I was talking to my friend who is a welder here and he told me to use his name so that if somebody wants one, they can get a hold of him. His name's Dave Sines. He's one of a, he's a very, very good welder in our area. And he fabricated and made the incredible winch matic for me out of the incredible winch that my other friend Bill sent me. So Bill, I know you're watching this. Thank you for the winch. I'm sorry it took me so long to get to using it, but I wasn't sure until I talked to Dave. And let me show you all the people that, all 12 of you folks that watch all my videos, let me show you how the incredible winch matic works. Now, I have already taken the winch matic and hooked it up to this rock. The winch matic slides into my class three hitch down here. That's a class three hitch. Slides into my class three hitch. Dave made it with a three point attachment up top. Now that three-point attachment is supposed to go one to the hook in the front of my truck on the pass driver's side, one to, to the hook on the passenger side, and one to stabilize it here. Because when you slide a class three hitch or almost anything you're sliding together, one's got to be smaller than the other. You know, a little bit of slop in there so it actually slides in. Well, there's a little bit of slop down here, which means at that height there, there's a lot of slop. So you just tie that off. Now, I've tied it off with rope because I didn't go to the hardware store because it's a 130-mile round trip. But what you want to do is you want to have cable for the three-point connection, and you want to have turnbuckles on the cable so you can tighten them down. We don't need that here. This rock is probably going to top out about 200 pounds. But I'll tell you, I make a big deal about picking them up. But if I pick up three of these 200-pounders, I'm going to feel it for a couple of days. But not with the incredible winch o -matic. Oops. You must first tighten the clutch on the incredible winchomatic. Now, let's try it again. The incredible winch omatic. There she goes. Let me just get my cable out of the way. And you gently release the rock down into the incredible winch uh, down from the incredible winch into the back of your truck, and there you go. 
Now there's a couple of design issues we need to change. But after all, this is a prototype. But that was pretty cool and that rock was a lot heavier than I thought. So that's one, let's go on to more. All right guys, I pretty much have all the rock I need up at the Eco Ranch. I can't hardly walk right now. I did want to test this out and I wanted to be sure Bill knew I appreciated it and I will use it. I'm just kind of loaded with rock right now. But these were four rocks I needed and I wanted to get the, I wanted to get the video of this fourth rock coming down. Uh, it's not as heavy as it looks, but it's big, it's bulky, and I've wanted it for a while. So let's give it a shot, huh? There she goes! probably have your engine running so I'm gonna go ahead and start up old mr. 300 K here Is, is oh boy yet another dent I'm happy but we got our limitations I can't get this in the truck with it at the angle it's at I have to actually have the truck facing downhill well guys, with that rock, it was just a matter of getting the thing pointed downhill, pointing it uphill, and she wanted to pull away. Downhill, it went right in. So I got her right in the back. The incredible winch o -matic. Works pretty damn good. Now, if I mentioned my friend Dave made this for me, I asked Dave if he wanted me to mention his name, and he said, yeah, sure, because he is a welder. He does do these things for a living. This is a one-time fabrication, a prototype, if you will. It's expensive. If we were making 10 of them, I say we, if he were making 10 of them, price would be cheaper. But what Dave wants for it, and I'll tell you, the parts involved are a carriage for your, um, for your class three hitch. Carriages can be anywhere from 25 to $45. It's a piece of, this is a piece of oil field pipe. If you're buying them, you really can't buy them in less than I think 23 foot lengths, and those are 50 bucks. 40 and 50 is 90. $15 for the uh, pulley. You could probably get a pulley for $10. Let's say $10, so you got $100 right there. Uh, plus the metal to fabricate. And uh, you know, plus the metal in the fabrication. Does not include the winch. So if he were to make one, just one for somebody, he would want $350. You provide the winch. A um, little pricey, but unless I stood on the side of the road like this, trying to get somebody to come and help me. That's the only way those rocks were going in. So it paid for itself. Bill, I love it. Thank you for giving it to me uh, or buying it for us, donating it to the Eco Ranch. Guys, if you want to donate anything to the Eco Ranch, go to the donate button on the main page. Um, or you can always just send me some uh, Portland or a gift, gift card from Lowe's or Home Depot to buy my own. Uh, McCoy's up in Alpine will also um, 
I'll take your credit card over the phone and hold the Portland for me. But I am beyond the incredible winch matic I hope you enjoyed it. I got more stuff like this coming. So until one of those comes, it's Robert Earl at the Eco Ranch, side of the road, actually, here in far west Texas. See you soon. Ha <laughs>